driving can change a person's life. It happened and changed Aaron Brooks. One day he was driving, took out his phone, and started texting his girlfriend. When he looked up, he realized that he was about to crash into the car in front of him. He didn't have enough time to put his foot on the brake and ended up being in a car crash. He was taken to the hospital and suffered from serious injuries. He fractured many bones and was later told that he was not able to walk again. Hillary Dickinson reported that Brookings used to be an athlete. He used to run, and his goal was that he wanted to do a marathon. Obviously, that won't happen. Before the accident, Brookins said he would text while drive about half the times he got into the car. He thought the text message he sent to his girlfriend would not leave him into a car accident. Just like Brookins, many people believe that texting and driving will not cause them to be an accident, when in fact it can happen to anyone at any time. Texting is a big problem in today's society. According to the National Safety Commission, 25% of auto accidents or 1.2 million accidents per year are attributed to cell phones. The Associated Press wrote that texting while driving is on the rise. That rose 50% of last year because many people believe that texting and driving is just not a big deal. When people text and drive, it actually slows their response time. April Castro wrote an article for the Associated Press said that reaction time slowed from one to two seconds without texting to three to four seconds with texting. Having a slow response time was a cause of Brookins' accident and many others. Reinberg, who wrote an article for the U.S. News, says that vehicle crashes account for more than one in three teen deaths per year. That's a lot. Although more people are buckling up and not driving drunk than in years past, more and more people are texting, and we need to change that. The problem is, is that there are still many states that don't ban a lot of texting, and law enforcement aren't just doing their part in stopping it. According to Sarah Cleave, um, who writes for the News Newsweek states, the reason is because bans are virtually useless in practice. That law enforcement don't know the difference between someone texting while driving or someone's just trying to find change. In order for the problem to be solved, law enforcement must be educated about texting while driving, and states need to ban the law of texting. Wisconsin actually becomes the 25th state to pass the law according to the Transportation Department. The Wisconsin law outlaws texting by all drivers. The first time violators get a fine between $20 to $400. And the second time violators get a fine between $200 and $800. That's definitely not worth a text message. Law enforcers need to start being more strict with their laws. If they suspect that someone is texting, they should pull them over and question them. Yahoo is reporting the National Highway Traffic Administration has set up a grant that will help police different help police test different anti-texting initiatives. The goal of the program is to find real-world protocols and practices to better dictate if a person is texting while driving. The program will test everything from anti-texting ad campaigns to spying on drivers. If people get caught more often with severe punishment, they will text less often. Texting and driving needs to be stopped. People may know the dangers, how yet it can how yet they proceed to do it. Not paying attention when driving can proceed you to do a slow react time from one to two seconds to three to four seconds. And texting while driving is on the rise when it definitely should not be. Texting can be stopped by having law enforcement go through training to detect texters and also to have more strict punishments and have states ban the law of texting. Texting and driving is very dangerous and can easily be stopped. The next time you pull out your phone, remember, do you want to end up like Brookins? Do you want to change your life over a simple text message? Texting can wait.